looks like Emma is hunting herself a rabbit. trying to catch her. Looks like a apple is having a nice bath in the food. <laughs> we are so excited. We finally got the pregnancy test, the blood drawn for the pregnancy test. So we got that dropped off today. She's in with the goats. Belle's in with the goats. We have set the live trap to try and catch Belle. We have not been successful, obviously. So we're gonna keep trying um, so we can get her in a more secure spot. Um, losing Papa was a hard blow. We don't know what happened. Probably will never know what happened. But um, we've grown from the situation and we are going to uh, see what we can do to better our fencing. Um, we've come out. Okay, where is she? She's in the shack? No. Okay, try to get her. Sam's gonna try and catch her. We were coming out to take a look at the colony, and Emma stole my boots. I do want to trade. So I'm wearing Jonah's boots. That's okay. And they're out of water. My Sam is a stinker. Yeah, he said they had water. They do not. Thought you were supposed to be getting water. Stinker. He gets distracted. <laughs> so he tells me he just barely filled this up. And um, I was like, no, you didn't. It's empty, all the way, all the way empty. So I was uh, looking at it again. And uh, I think I see a bit of a problem. Let's see if you guys can see the problem as well. Well, <sighs> kind of hard to see the problem. I thought I could show you better. There's a hole in the bottom. So, uh, <laughs> always something, isn't there? So, uh, not sure what we're gonna do. <laughs> that looks amazing. She's kind of like, oh no. It's actually not too bad. If we clipped it back like this. I wanna go, <laughs> can I go see? Yeah, you can, you, you, we can make you look like Queenie. <laughs> Emma is getting Missy ready for the play. They have their um, rest rehearsal tonight, the last dress rehearsal. Um, the play opens tomorrow. James and the Giant Peach Jr., I'm so proud. These girls have worked very hard. It's been a very big time commitment for them. And uh, tomorrow's opening night. So we're really excited about that. Um, we had a wonderful time yesterday. We um, had the opportunity to go to a family member's wedding. Um, we'd hoped to do more vlogging, but instead we just decided to enjoy the day. Um, we decided to go get a hotel since the wedding is about three hours away. We decided to get a hotel and instead of traveling so early in the morning. Sarah is pretty cranky, <laughs> but um, we had a great time. And what made it great is our awesome friend Mama Grows. Kathleen from the channel Mama Grows, check her out. We'll link to her um, channel in the description. And she put up a beautiful video about our adventure with her. So big ol' shout out to her. The next um, few minutes footage is gonna be something that she did for us. Um, she babysat our kids while Jonah and I were able to attend um, the ceremony. And then the kids came for pictures after. But um, couldn't have done it without her. She was amazing. The kids had a great time and enjoy the footage. <laughs> I found an adventure. 
back of memories, my only luck, yeah. I'm trying to travel like the way I love it. I never really care about the distance. I let the music guide me, be my mistress. And all the places I have seen, they all felt like a home. see the area, to feed them lunch, to show them my rabbits, try and convince Jonah that the red eye is not that A big demon thing. rabbit? <laughs> I'm not convinced yet. <laughs> but I got to hang out with Spike. Yeah, yeah. They didn't come to see me, they came to see Spike. That's so true. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you for coming along with us today on this crazy adventure. We well, like to call homesteading. Yeah. We like to call homesteading. Give us a thumbs up. Hopefully we will see you guys tomorrow. Traveling with food allergies is not an easy thing. Um, if you caught yesterday's vlog, um, you will know that we had to put down our Papa Bunny. Um, if you want more information, check out that vlog. But um, that happened the day that we were getting ready to leave. So leaving the homestead, one, is hard because you've got so much to do with your animals and everything else that you need to, you need to do. I forgot and I left my Instant Pot plugged in. Um, but there's always too much to do when you're trying to get ready to go. And then when you have something that comes up that you weren't expecting, um, that really took a big chunk of my time, so I was not able to prepare or bring any food for myself. Um, we've got my extensive food allergies, a hot breakfast at the hotel means I got to eat an apple and a gross banana. <laughs> But it was good, at least it had something, right? Um, but Kathleen gave us a beautiful gift of lunch. So, so it wasn't just the gift of watching the kids and helping so the kids could enjoy more time in the hotel. Um, it was food for me, you know. All I all had to eat that day was the apple and, and banana and uh, she made hamburgers and it was beautiful. Just beautiful to have such a caring, sweet friend that would sacrifice so much of her time for us. So thank you Kathleen at Mama Grows for being an amazing friend 